Lucas Media. Shout out to the ones who support me and the ones who hate me. Ryan Garcia just went off on Earl Spence. I know I'm a little late on it, but came across it on Fine Hype's channel. And he goes off to say F Earl Spence and, you know, said he was high before the fight with Terrence Crawford. That's why Crawford was beating him. And that he bogus for not paying Derek James what he's supposed to pay. Also saying I paid him. I paid him more in one fight than uh, Earl has. And he's paid him less. Something like that. Honestly, we don't know what's going on between Earl and Derek James. Honestly, only them two know. Boxing is very shady. You never know. Especially when there's a, a handshake deals, if it ain't on, if it ain't written down, it don't mean nothing. And I just wish that that was something that these fighters would, and trainers, and everybody involved with boxing would understand. Boxing is a very shady business; it's always been. So you never know, you know what what they, what Derek James is old. I really hope the fall ain't in over money. And I know that Derek and Earl have been together since before Earl turned pro. And a lot of times you see this and it bothers me. Whenever a fighter lose, usually they'll switch it up and change trainers. Or like what Triple G did with Abel Sanchez, he ended up letting them go before he was able before he had to pay Abel Sanchez that huge payday. And Jeff Mayweather said this before. He said, if I'm gonna train you. We gonna have we gonna have a contract, so you can't cheat me out of no money. But you know Ryan, he don't know. He just going on a rant. People still are just saying Ryan doing whatever. I watched his um, him and De I mean uh, Devin Haney's forty days, and Ryan said that there's always a method to the madness. But he don't know what's really going on, honestly, and nobody should believe that. The only people who really know was. Is Derrick James, Earl Spence, and they camps. I would like to see them two brothers continue to work together, especially when they made history, collecting three out of the four belts and one of the one of the major boxing weight classes. But yeah, I'm not gonna believe Ryan. It, it, if if it don't come from Earl or Derrick James, you gotta take it with a grain of salt. But I just want to get my quick thoughts about what Ryan said. What y'all think?